99% of people are gonna make this mistake when scavenging for resources after disaster strikes. Once all of the low hanging fruit has been exhausted, that's when people start going for the high hanging fruit. So that's when people start going off the beaten path and getting more clever in their machinations. So the furthest back in the supply chain is the actual crop coming out of the ground. Then you have the train cars that the grain is loaded onto. Then it goes to like the Robin Hood facility. They're gonna process the flour. Then the flour is put in bags. It's taken to the consolidated food places like the distribution centers. Then from there, it's distributed to the grocery stores, the retail outlets, the gas stations, anywhere else they might sell those types of products. So the further up the supply chain you go, the less competition you're gonna have at the start, but people are gonna get wise. 